Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh, oh my gosh, oh my gosh. What's going on everyone? James here with another real reaction and today I'm going to be watching the series finale for the Clone Wars for the very first time. That's right, season 7, episode 12, Victory and Death. I am not emotionally prepared for this. I love this show so much. Season 7 is the most cinematic of the bunch. Might not be my favorite season so far, but I do love this final arc. I think it's beautiful, poetic, and also incredibly sad. We just saw Order 66 begin to get executed in Episode 11. If you missed any of my reactions for this final arc, by the way, find it in the description below or floating around at the top of the screen. But y'all, I'm already sad. Now, before we get into the final episode of The Clone Wars, if it is your first time here at the channel, welcome to Real James, where I love talking about movies, TV, and talking about all the news in between. So if you do too, go ahead and hit the big red button below, subscribe to the channel, tap on the bell, and hit the thumbs up button for more content just like this. And let me know down below in the comments two things. One, what's your favorite episode of the series? And two, how did you feel about the finale when you first watched it? Um, I don't have any tissues around, but I might need to find some because I was told it's going to rip my heart out. Alrighty, y'all. Well, you know what? I'm gonna stop talking, and let's get into the very final episode of The Clone Wars. <sighs> mm. The score already is getting to me. Ah, <laughs> <sighs> uh, the final time. <laughs> it's been such a great journey. Get yeah, a sad one. Oh, see, here I was thinking that <laughs> there was a Jedi coming through the door, but it's just the troopers. Oh, of course. Oh, Ahsoka's so smart. Man, Ahsoka and Rex, they're such a darn good team. I'm sad we'll probably never see that team up again. Oh, Rex is feeling so, so guilty right now, but... Oof. Dang, Darth Maul just went straight for the jugular. Literally. <laughs> that was cool that he caught the helmet. I mean, Darth Maul, he's a beast, dog. Getting through this entire clone army. I mean, that's... It's... Wow. Wait, is he gonna try to take down the Star Cruiser? Like, what are you doing, cuz? Because that also will kill you. Yeah, the hyperdrive. Yeah, it, there ain't no more hyperdrive for this ship. <laughs> wow, look at this shot. Oh my gosh. Oh man. Oh, this thing is definitely gonna explode. Yep, there we go. R7, open the main hangar doors. Open the main hangar doors, girl. What is you doing, Ahsoka? What is she trying to do? We need to get out of here. Are, are they just gonna... They're just gonna let this ship just crash right into this moon, I guess. Yeah, I mean... Oh, wow. Okay. <laughs> this thing's falling apart. <laughs> Ain't no saving this thing. There are too many. Besides, I don't want to hurt them. Dang, Ahsoka's heart is made of gold. Hmm. What is happening here? What it is Rex gonna sacrifice himself here? No. No. You're a good soldier, Rex. Oh no, please. What guys, why is this setting up for like Rex? No. I'm happy to be wrong if Rex is not gonna die, but like it's surely setting up for it. Okay, I hope this idea includes saving Rex. <laughs> Please. And of course saving Ahsoka, even though we know she's alive, right? So emotional. Oh, they're playing... It's like the Trojan horse angle, aren't they? Yeah, mm-hmm. Dang, Jesse called Ahsoka Tano an it? I don't like Jesse. <laughs> oh, she's a citizen, right! Oh my gosh, Ahsoka's so smart, dog. Oh, dang, dog. Uh, Jesse wasn't buying any of that. Oh 
my gosh, they're so smart. I love Ahsoka and Rex together, guys. I want a series with just these two. <laughs> Is Maul gonna take that ship, though? Maul, you've been doing okay right now, but, like, don't play. Alright, bye now? Maul has taken the ship. <laughs> Maul, I'm so mad at you, dog. Shouldn't have expected any less. Oh, Ahsoka! What a beast! Yes, Ahsoka! Oh no, R7! Dang it, dog! No, no Rex. Oh my gosh, they keep teasing Rex's death. Wait, Ahsoka let Maul go? To save Rex, right? That's gotta be it, guys. Yeah. Ahsoka, man, I love her, dude. <laughs> what was that, Ahsoka? That was so dope! Y'all, the Ahsoka moments this season. Chef's kiss. Oh my gosh. You know, I'm gonna be honest, I didn't expect us to get so much... Or so little of Anakin and Obi-Wan. I thought we might get some Ahso Ahsoka and then some Anakin, you know, back and forth, but... They're leaning heavy on Ahsoka and Rex right now, which I am okay with. Oof. I, for a minute, I didn't know if Rex was gonna hold on. Oh no, Ahsoka, she's getting tired. I gotta get out of there, dog. Come on, Ahsoka, get there, get there. Oh my gosh! That's, that's a, it's a Y-Wing, right? Yeah, that thing is going all out of sorts. <laughs> wow. Come on, save Ahsoka, find her, Rex, find her. Right there, she's right there. Why am I pointing? Of course, like, yeah, she sure. help find it. <laughs> yes, oh my gosh, yes. No, no, I thought she had it. <laughs> Dog, this is crazy. Come on, come on. Second time's a charm. This is taking way too long for- Come on, this is taking way too long. Just grab onto it, Ahsoka, grab onto it! Oh, thank goodness. Oh my gosh, jeez Louise, bro. That was one of the craziest escape missions I've ever seen in Star Wars. <laughs> oh my gosh. Well, that ship represents the uh, state of the galaxy. <laughs> it's broken. Man, you gotta imagine Rex feels awful right now. So does Ahsoka, because she had a close tie to the clones, and... Man, what a shot, though. I don't know whether to be, like, in awe of this and, like, sad. Probably both. Dog, oh, this is crazy. I've been saying this is crazy all episode, but this is crazy. Is she gonna leave her lightsaber there? No way, Ahsoka. I guess this is her finally being completely done with... The Jedi? I don't know, but like, dang. Oh man, maybe she just feels like she failed him. I hear this breathing, I know this breathing. What's that Darth Vader? Cause this is like, time has passed for sure. It's Vader, that's gotta be Vader. Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh, oh my gosh, oh my gosh. How much time has passed, dog? And he's gonna remember that's Ahsoka's saber. Dog. Oh my gosh. Dude. Oh, there's so much emotion right now. Isn't it crazy the last time we saw Anakin? Was when he was giving those sabers to Ahsoka? <sighs> what a shot. Vader in the helmet. 
Oh my gosh. And that's it. That's it. That is the end of the Clone Wars. All seven seasons finally watched for the very first time. I am... Whew, there's a lot to break down. Um, I genuinely, genuinely did not expect a, an Ahsoka Rex centric episode. I did think we were going to get a little bit more of Anakin and Obi-Wan, but I understand why they focused on Ahsoka because we already know what happens with Anakin and Obi-Wan, don't we? So it's nice to see everything unfold. Uh, outside of that main plot line and wow oh wow i was a big fan of that escape mission it was one of the most grand spectacles that star wars has ever offered and i'm, I'm just in awe <laughs> this actually adds another bit of weight to when we see ahsoka in the mandalorian and how she well is unwilling to train grogu because she's done with the jedi completely and all together so man i am just kudos to everyone involved, Dave Filoni, Kevin Kleiner with the score, all of the voice talent, I mean just beautifully beautifully done and Ahsoka Tano has officially solidified her spot on my Mount Rushmore of Star Wars characters. Um, she's just incredible man, this entire series is incredible and it's just that one final shot of Darth Vader like picking up the saber understanding that well Ahsoka she was there and if anything, that that moment kind of that that was Anakin. That wasn't Vader in that moment. You know what I mean? So it's just, it's beautifully done. But let me know in the comments down below what you guys thought of the finale and what your takeaway is from this series as a whole. And go ahead and subscribe to the channel for more reactions just like this. And now I guess I go ahead and start Rebels, right? Yeah. All right. I'm excited. Again, thanks so much for sticking with me through this final arc in this journey. And I'll catch you at the next screening.